Hello. Wanna say hi? Well, she did not pass the car seat test. I've been crying all morning if you can't tell the puffy eyeballs. But it's okay. Um very disappointed and sad because we've been here for going on six weeks next Monday and I'm ready to take my baby home she's met all of her goals she is 34 weeks and today's Wednesday, Wednesday 34 weeks and three days Wednesday or Thursday I don't know if it's Monday or Thursday. if it's Thursday she's 34 weeks and four days Wednesday, three days. But um, she's passed everything that she needs to pass. She's 34 weeks. She's bottle feeding exclusively. Um, she's getting my breast milk, even though I'm having a very hard time still for that to come in. I don't know what to do regarding that. I've been trying. It's okay. So she's getting um, formula and breast milk, as much breast milk as I can possibly give her. Um, she can keep her own temperature. So she's doing very good for a 34 week old baby. Um, it's just very hard uh, coming to the hospital every single day. I'm generally here from like 9.30, actually 9.30 in the morning because rounds are done at 10. 9.30 in the morning till 11 o'clock at night every single day. Um, so I am sleeping. Not at least eight hours but it's still hard having to come see your baby here instead of being able to take care of her at home um so how am I feeling today sad but not defeated we're going to try again in 48 hours to see if she can pass the car seat test she basically can't go home until she does pass it basically what the car seat test is is her just sitting in her car seat and um, being able to maintain her breathing and her oxygen levels. And when she does go into her car seat, her oxygen level starts to go a little low. Um, so it's not anything to worry about. I just have to keep reminding myself that, yes, she is little. She's little. She's little. She's little. She's doing things way before her time to actually do them. So upset and sad, yes, but defeated, no. We are ahead of schedule, so we are doing what we're supposed to be doing. Uh, we will try again in a couple days. Um, regarding my previous comment regarding breastfeeding, it is extraordinarily hard. Um, I've talked to multiple different lactation specialists, and um, they're all saying the same thing. It's going to come in, it's going to come in, but she's six weeks old now, and I'm only literally getting a ounce and a half generally every time I do pump. And I'm pumping around the clock every three hours, um, and there's still nothing more is coming in. I've attempted to breastfeed or just to have her latch on, which she does just fine, but still it's not um, prompting my body to make any additional milk, so it's very, very hard. Um, I've tried drinking the teas, the fenugreek pills, Gatorade, oatmeal. Um, the only thing I haven't tried yet is actually making my own lactation cookies with the brewery, so I think I'm going to try that um, over this weekend. Um, we'll keep trying it to see what happens. Uh, hopefully that will work. Also, um, one of my doctors uh, wanted me to try something called um, Don Peridome, um, which from what I'm understanding is um, it was a military pill, and um, one of the side effects from that was um, increased lactation. So they said that that helps a lot when it comes to that, but they do cost a lot. Um, she told me to go someplace called inhousepharmacy.vu. Um, they changed their 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 uh, um, web address a lot, so you have to try to get them when they have it when when it's there. If you do look it up online. You'll see that it's a dot vu dot just a dot com dot it just a dot a lot <laughs> basically dot a lot, um, but I'm going to keep trying. I'm not going to stop. I know that with her being so little, this is the best thing that I could do for her is to give her as much of my breast milk as I can possibly do. 
I am uh, not going to stop hoping that she goes home every day. Um, so hopefully we will be able to go home in a couple of days. I'm tired of being here. If you can't tell I've been crying all morning because even though I knew yesterday she wasn't going to come home, um, it still kind of hurt when I when they did the test when I wasn't here. Uh, I wanted them to just because even though I knew she wasn't going to come home, I I was hoping, still hoping last night and this morning before I got here, that somehow, some way she would pass that um, car seat test, but she did. Um, so just hearing it officially that yes, your daughter failed kind of was a little much for me this morning and I just didn't really want to talk to anybody so I've been really quiet in my little room yeah <laughs> my teeny tiny room but it is okay um we will give you guys another up well if anyone sees this really <laughs> we'll give you a new update as of tomorrow have a good day